What is up, hashtag Soundman Squad? It is Trainer Crego here with another Battle Styles booster box. And if you did not see the last Battle Style video we did, I 100% recommend that you go check it out. We pulled some really awesome cards. And um, today we're just hoping to pull some better ones. Um, we definitely had probably pretty good luck in the last box, I think. I think hits were about on par with what they're going to be. Um, and we definitely got some of the high hitting cards, um, but we're definitely still searching for a few. Um, any of the gold cards would be great. Love to see some of the full arts that they have. Uh, I'd really like to pull an Empoleon full art, because Empoleon was probably my favorite Pokemon um, from Gen 4 growing up. So we're going to start with the left hand side this time. We started with the right the first time around. And uh, left side won last time, so we'll see if uh, right side wins this time. Or if we get a repeat of a left-sided victory. Still have not gotten my hands on a ETB, so I haven't like fully reviewed the full card list. I know I can do it online. Um... I just really haven't gotten to it yet, so we'll see. Frillish, Cheruby, Lickitung, Electrobuzz. That's only that would be a cool hollow, honestly. Esper, a Tool Jammer, and a Luxray Hollow, which we now have three of this bad boy. It's a nice hollow though. I can't I cannot complain. Um I'd really like to get an Entei Hollow though. That's probably my favorite hollow of the set from the hollows that uh, either I've pulled or I've seen. Um, so yeah. Let me know in the comments what your favorite card of the set is. I think mine has probably got to be that Tyranitar, um, but also the gold cards are very, very nice looking. Uh, I haven't seen all the full art, so I'm not 100% sure what is there, but a Vil Vivillian. And a Pavilion regular. I was about to say that would be a cool hollow, but I guess it doesn't come in a hollow form. But we doubled up, confirming our suspicions on whether or not it came in a hollow form. Girder, Cacturn, another Electabuzz, a Bell Sprout, Bronzor. There's a little bronzer in the background as well. Murkrow. Horsia. I still think that's my favorite Horsia card. Any Bulltound. I got might be... Is, is that Horsia common or... Let's check. Where did it go? Yeah, that's a common. That's probably my favorite common in the set. I mean, that Electabuzz looks cool, but that Horsia... I don't know. I think it's a very nice looking Horsia. All right, Cheryl. Cheryl's a very nice full art. Malwile, Cherub, Pachirisu, Chimchino, or Chimcho, Octillery, and there we go. There's the uh, uh, your Shifu VMAX. I don't know if this is the alternative art, and I don't think that it is, um, but that is a very nice pull nonetheless. We only got one VMAX, I'm pretty sure, in the last box, and it was a Victini, so it is nice not to see a repeat of our VMAXs. But I don't think that's I don't think that's the alternative art or um Yeah, no, I don't I don't think that's the alternate art. I know the there's a blue one. I don't know if that's the rapid or the single strike. But that's a very nice looking card. Crawdont. Rumpig, Energy, Houndor, Scatterbug, Gligar, Agislash, and an Agislash again. Agislash Hollow, not a bad card either. I mean, I really enjoy the Hollows in this set. Um, and I gotta remember that Hollows are like not even terrible cards to pull. Just because I'm so used to all these like sets, like Champion's Path, um, Shiny Fates, Hidden Legends, where like they're not, like Hollows aren't what you're going for. Yamper, Lickitung, the Zubat Crochet, Remoraid, Spoink, and a Mr. Rhyme. Regular rare.
Ignite, Bouflant, Cacnea, Ponyard, Timber, Tepig, Glamio, a Bellsprout, and a Karina's Focus. Oh my god, I'm pretty sure this is actually the best full art card that you can pull. Um, wow. Wow, wow, wow. That's our first full art of, like our full art, first full art trainer of the set. It's a great looking card. Let's just get that in a little bit more. Ooh, there we go. Karina's Focus. Nice. That's a very nice card. I think, yeah, probably the best trainer card. So this, this side of the box has been great already. Maybe left side of the box is where all the hits are at. So uh, you get a chance to uh, get a booster box like in stores and uh, you're not sure. Maybe just, maybe just start pulling from the left side. Um, I've been getting massive hits on the left side. Right side has been uh, not so much, but there we go. Karina's focus. The the colossal. I just saw the carcoal, but the colossal, the holographic is probably the coolest holographic, and there's a crowbat. The coolest holographic in the set. Like that one was probably my favorite. I just got like random sleeves over here. Some are like perfect fits. Some are not. My perfect fit sleeve should be coming in the mail pretty soon, and then I can. Put all these bad boys in my binder. But it's been a lot, a lot of cards. Four from the back. Dotler, Dublade, Mr. Rhyme. No, that's Mr. Rhyme. I don't know when it's Mr. Rhyme and when it's Mr. Rhyme, honestly. Ooh, I think that's the first time we've actually seen this common card, this Sizzlopede. It's like clay. Very nice. Shinx. A Senna Scorch. Oh, is there a Senna Scorch holographic? That'd be awesome. Lorantis. Senna Scorch is slowly becoming one of my all time favorite Pokemon. Probably my favorite Pokemon in um, in Generation, whatever it is. Was it seven or eight? I'm not 100% sure when Senna Scorch came in, but it's slowly becoming my favorite card of that generation, like that Pokemon. And climbing on my list of now we're now we're just seeing a bunch of sizzlepeeds. Timber, cherub. Wow, wow, let's go. A rainbow rare trainer card. Little centering uh, issue from right to left. Top to bottom looks a little better. But holy cow. I don't know, Phoebe Rainbow Rare is probably the best Rainbow Rare trainer. I didn't even know there was Phoebe in this set. Holy. That's probably worth a pretty penny right there. So there is our first seeker rare of this set. I mean, technically I got the 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 falafel in a different in a different like opening when I did it myself, but that is our first secret rare on camera. I mean, I really don't know how the right side is going to come back from this if it even can which i don't think it can but holy cow like left side has been dominating with these booster boxes maybe just don't even bother getting the right side of booster boxes girder cedra sparrow pachirisu cherub silicobra oh, sorry i was holding that a little high hound door and a rapid strike yurshifu v Should still be on par for getting maybe another full art. Um, Got to get a couple more V cards as well. It's like we still definitely got some cards to pull. But damn, we've really gotten our big hitter cards. We've gotten them quickly. Crawdont, Dublade, Cactia, Roly Coly, Shinx, Esper, Blip Bug, a Electabuzz, and a Phalanx. I thought I was going to see a lot more Phalanxes. Um, Looks like people were pulling those a lot, but uh, I haven't really been, been getting too many of them. Golbat, Bisharp, Energy, Recycler, Mankey, Malwile, Phomantis, Remoraid, a Conkledur, Conkledur, any Primeape. Might be the first time we've actually seen that one too. We've probably seen all, we're coming around to seeing all the, probably the commons and uncommons. More or less. Fire energy, weeping bell, and DD. Actually, no, I don't think we've seen this. 
but this is a Sorward and Shielbert. Electabuzz, Esper, Timber, Galarian Slopo, Corfish, a Bronzong. The regular rare Senna Scorch. up a storm right now. Yes? What? What? Ooh. Hi. Hey, trying to do this with a cat on your lap is <laughs> difficult. No, please don't touch the camera. You can see his whiskers coming into focus. What are you doing? Come on, just stay on my lap. Silicobra, Houndor, Lickitung, a Lickitung, and a Steelix holographic. I didn't even know there was Steelix in this set. That's a nice looking holo. What? Hi. Nice looking holo Steelix. There's the card. Okay, he's like standing. Move. No, do not walk in front of the screen. What are you doing? All right, there's some cat action going on, but <laughs> escape rope. Bronzor, Murkrow, Horsia, Cherub, Lickitung, Baltoy, and an Agislash regular rare. There's actually two versions of the Agislash. Um, there's a hollow and a non-hollow in the rare slot, which is kind of interesting. Cat distraction out of the way, we can get moving. Phoebe, oh, there's our, there's the uh, regular rare version of her. Cacnea, Spoink, Roly Coly, Frillish, Tower of Waters, and a Galarian Slowbro, which I don't think we've seen. Could be a very nice uh, hollow pull. I, I, again, I don't know how many hollows are actually in the set. Um, so. And this is the last pack of the left side, so it's been a great left side so far. Carvana, Scatterbug, Honage, Gligar, Electabuzz, Bellsprout, Horsia, Reverse, first time we pulled that, and a Minshao. So we're just going to clean up the space a little bit. to the right side of the packs. Let's get something good. It's been a while since we've seen a card that has been uh, worth mentioning. I think the last one was that Steelix holographic a few packs ago. Cheryl, Bisharp, Honage, Electabuzz. Oh, that was weird. Gligar, Salandit, Isidra. I didn't even know that was a card. And another Embor holographic we did get one of in the last opening. All right, Energy, Gliscor, Tepig, Glamiao, Silicobra, Frillish, Houndor, a Roly Coly and a Mimic UV card, which we have not seen. This one's actually like really creepy. Like that's it's an ominous looking ominous 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 looking Mimic U. Am 
trash can is just filled with Pokemon cards. It's been like two days, three days between these videos, and I've just opened so many. I've opened two booster boxes after this, six packs on their own, so that's like what? That's 78 packs, something like that. Coracle and a Lorantis. And like we've had some pretty good luck with 78 packs. Love to see maybe one more VMAX. Um, I think we, I think that Rainbow Rare is our, that's our Seeker Rare. So uh, still a nice card to pull. Wooflant, Minfu, Shinx, Cacnea, Honeyard, a Timber, a Vavillion, and a Claydol. But we should be in store for three more Hollows, I'd say. Maybe a V or two. We should still get our VMAX full art, or, or V full art at some point. Um, not really sure when, but it should be coming up. Cheryl, Heatmore, Tower of Darkness, Salandit. Because I think you're guaranteed at least one per box. Could be wrong, though. Glamiao, Esper. Ooh, and a Falapple VMAX. So there's our second VMAX of the day. And this is the card that I did pull off screen uh, in a Rainbow Rare version, actually. So that's very nice. And I think we have the Falapple V as well. So we've got that full lineage. Still haven't seen that uh, Empoleon anywhere. Empoleon, full art, or regular. I, I, I don't even know if it comes in a regular V. Or if it has a uh, hollow card. But I want that Entei hollow as well. So, Pig Knight, Level Ball, Morpeko, Yamper, Murkrow, Salandit, a Belt Sprout, a Cheryl, and a Gelescent. Blade, Mustard, Sizzlipede. I've seen like four or three of those guys now. After like never seeing any Licky Tongue. Ooh, and it's Happy Coco V. We pulled, we might have pulled the Tapu Coco V, I think. We pulled one of the Tapus. I don't know how many Tapus there are. But I think we got, we got one of them. I don't know if there's four in the set or this just one. Pokemon's kind of odd in the sense where they like include some Pokemon in a set and then not in others. It's very interesting how they do it. Onyx assist. Now we've pulled so many of those after. Ooh, an Octillery. I think it, is there an if there's not an Empoleon holographic, we're really only missing like the Entei Hollow. It's like the one hollow I really want to pull. It's like the, uh, well, like, I'm not going to spoil it because you guys haven't seen that video yet. Um, I, it's already been recorded, but you haven't seen it yet, so I'm not going to say anything. But it, it's just like cards that I wanted to pull were less rare than cards that I did end up pulling. And it was like just kind of crazy how I pulled other cards before pulling the cards that I wanted that were just less rare, if that makes sense. Turn Rapid Strike Sparrow, the Crocheted V Zubat, <laughs> V Bat, uh, Onyx, and a Drampa. Eight packs left, so we got a uh, little, a little less than a fourth of this box left. So let's see what we can do. Water Towers, Luxio. Weeping Bell, Sparrow, Pachirisu, Cherub, Silly Cobra, a Luxio, not a Luxray, and a Victory Bell. Let's see what, what packs we got left. Napoleon, Tyranitar, Tyranitar. We're going to open all the, the Usurfu packs first. Hopefully, like, flipping those around doesn't mean we're going to get, like, six hits. Or not six hits. Like, like we're going to get all our hits and then nothing else. Towards the end, that would stink. So I try to like mix, mix it up. Ooh, fire energy is in an omen. <laughs> there's there's no like good fire Pokemon like in this set, I think. Ooh, but an orbital. I think like that one just really pops comparatively. Like really pops out. Pulled him before. 
I'm a big fan of this card, actually. Just the way that it pops looks very nice. Uh -oh. Horsia, Mankey, Malwile, Fomantis, Remoraid, Phalanx Reverse, and a Phalanx right. I was going to say, Phalanx I really thought was going to be one of those Pokemon that you pull like all the time and you're like, please give me something other than a gosh darn Phalanx. Let me know in the codes like what you guys are getting. I always, I always love to hear. I don't think anybody's actually pulled like a super chase card from any of my codes, but that'd be really cool. A Sizzlipede. Oh, that is a Hollow. Interesting. That's a Sand Dakota. Hollow. Oh, there's a print line running through the side right there. I run through the entire card. Wow. But yeah. Never pulled this one before, so there we go. All right, come on, give me something good. We've only gotten two V cards, maybe three. Like regular Vs, not like Full Arts or V Maxes. Cacnea, Spoink, Roly Coly, Frillish, a Phoebe, and a Victini. I feel like Victini is always doing like this or that, or it's always got its fingers up. I feel like the Victini arts have never really changed over the years. But maybe, maybe that's just me. All right, come on, I want a V, I want a V full art. Girder, like I'm happy with my two V maxes, but I'd really like a V full art. Shinx, Drampa. Got two left, a Tyranitar and an Napoleon. And then we are done with this box. I think this box was better than the other one. I don't know. Like, we got a really good card in the other one. Uh, but this one, we definitely got more, like, big hitters. Agislash, Marowak. And we are down to our final pack. We really like to end with a bang. So, let's go. Water Energy, Spewa, Ice Gore, Esper, Billipub, Pill, uh, Pillbug, <laughs> Lickitung, a Crocheted Zubat, and ready, we're going to flick this off, and it's going to be the Entei Holographic. Oh, oh, it's red. Or orange. Come on. Come on. Ah, Salazzle. Regular rare. Still, nothing to complain about. I think left side wins again. Um... So maybe in the future, buy left side boxes if you get the chance. That would be my recommendation. Still no, still really nothing, nothing too bad, nothing too great, but nothing too bad from the box. Oh no, we got four Vs. Um, it's about maybe what I've expected. No V full arts though. But Embor, San Dakota, oop. Or Beetle, probably the, my favorite, just the way it pops. Octillery, Luxray, Crobat, Steelix, Holographic, the Mimikyu V, Tapu Koko V, Victini V, and Urshifu the V, the Falapple V Max, the Yershifu V Max, the Karina's Force Full Art. And the icing on this cake, this video is brought to you by Phoebe Rainbow Rare Full Art Trainer Card. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.